So show me how you would arm wrestle. Ready, go. Ah. Rogan again. We can curl it. We can't curl it. Factory with Leroy the Machine Walker. There you go. <laughs> Another amazing strength athlete who's wanting to get into arm wrestling. I'm telling you, this sport's growing, guys. Got some good content. This dude's doing all kinds of strict curls, crazy presser, and we're gonna see what he can do on the table. Check it out. All right. Whatever arm you're arm wrestling with, that's the leg you want to step forward with. So right hand to step forward. You get the, okay, so I said I just set right there. Yeah. When you go to pin, get your arm up here. When you go to pin, you want that arm to fall off the table. So just like this. Yeah. All right. So what we start right here is you're too far off the table, so get it nice and tight. Tuck your body into the table. Like that. Okay. So show me how you would arm wrestle. Ready? Go. Right. So I'm gonna go. Give me some pressure. I'm gonna pull three here real quick and then just see where you go. Ready? Go. So. Obviously, you have crazy curling strength, and your hand feels strong. What I like to do is called riser. So you take your knuckle and you point it straight up. That's the first thing. We're going to scoot you over this way so you center your body a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Get this in. Okay, so if you're going to do a one arm row, right? I know you got big pressing power, but you got good rolling power too, don't you? Yeah. If you're going to bend over to pick up something, how much strong would you be if you put your hand here to pull? Good a lot. A lot. So let's push with this hand. On go, imagine arm wrestling being a tug of war. Mm -hmm. Wrap your hand around the back of my hand and pull me to you. So drag your elbow. You have open front. So use that big back. You're ready to go. Pull straight back. Right. See, are you pushing here? Yeah. yeah. So that's that back pressure. Ready to go. Boom. Boom. Now, so that, that's still staying tight at the table. Use your abdomen yeah. as another, you know, area to press against. So it's, it's just leverage. So if I push my abdomen tight up, I'm going to do it to you. Do the same thing you just did. Ready to go. Back pressure. Try to match my back pressure. Ready to go? Oh, this one is pulling me back. Yeah. But I'm using this to push and I'm using my abdominals to push. So from here, pull back, take your fingertips, crush your wrist straight down into a wrist curl, and then take your thumb and roll through my hand as you're dropping the towels. So don't twist. Mm -hmm. Let that arm fall. Just fall without twisting the shoulders. Look at look, so look this way. So, yeah, so that way you're not twisting as much. Do it again. So you're still twisting with your shoulders. So what you're doing this motion, mm -hmm. and I want you to do this motion. Okay. So imagine you're pulling the whole time, right? And some more. So just pull and drop. That way. You got to drag your elbow. Nope, drag your elbow. Drag, 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 drag. Okay. So drag your elbow first. Now go to the left. Without twisting. Second. Yeah, so here, we're going to get you. We're gonna transition this over to that uh, RR handle and we're gonna get your technique down. Okay. This is gonna be key. So, from a position, your starting position, mm -hmm. put your elbow right here, boom, and then you crank your wrist and pull through your hand and drop your body. See how you, you're trying to twist. Mm -hmm. See how I'm dropping with my body? Okay. So, try that. See how it feels. Get a nice and tight step in the table, real nice and tight, elbow in the air. I want you to bend in your hips. Ready, go. Without twisting. Yeah, and then drag your elbow. See how you're falling off the table, twist back? Let that arm come off. Let me off. hop back in here again and show you. So, what you're doing is you're falling off backwards. Like, when you set up, you're falling here. Okay. You want to push this into the table. And then you just bend sideways. Okay. But see this arm? Yeah, see how this is going yeah. here? Off the table. Okay. Your big no, arm no. is stopping it, right? Yeah, you're, you're such a big dude that when you sit in here, you either want to pull off this way or you want to pull this way. Uh -huh. And all you have to do is just pull straight back. Okay. So you're dipping into this side of the table. Just keep working on that technique. This step in even closer to the table. Yeah, right foot to the right a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Right foot to the right. Step your right foot up, left foot, okay, there you go. Now just, boom. That's good, but you're still twisting. Keep going. Just keep working. Now drag your elbow. Drag your elbow to the left. Take your elbow and put it over here. 
Come on, get it. Ready, go. Keep going. Keep going. Okay, so uh, we're gonna go back and watch the video so that you can see yeah. what you're doing. Your elbow, a lot of times, just stay in here. Okay. Because you're just thinking old tomorrow arm wrestling, right? Mm -hmm. So you're literally, just, it's hilarious because you're just like, <laughs> it's like, that strong, you know, it's like, I'm just gonna pin it with that. So what I need you to do is take the front of the elbow, yeah. back pressure to the rear, go sideways from here. Okay. So it, it actually ends up being a diagonal pull from up here to here. Okay. The reason we took the pin pad off is for training. Yeah. If you get used to pinning to the tabletop, when you hit the pin pad, it's a lot easier. It's nice and tight. So just get it, get all this tight before you start. Like get as close to your, pull this as close to your face as you can, like the hardest curl. Get in, see how your body needs to be tighter? Now just try to pin right over here. It's not bad. Still you yeah. move that elbow. Get elbow over there. there you go. See that elbow right here. Try to touch my finger with the elbow. Drag the tip of your elbow all the way to that corner. All the way to here, all the way to here. Pulling it backwards. Don't even go for the pin yet until you touch my finger. Further over, further over, further over. All the way to here. Now go to the pin. That's actually better. Yeah. That's actually better. That's um, so what happens is the strap got high on your hand here, so it's yeah. holding up and down instead of being right here. Uh -huh. So because you're so strong, we're gonna get him on the uh, the single pulley system and let because I've got a weight that's over there set up for 287 pounds. Okay. Single pulley average weight. So uh, no one has pinned it yet. I pinned 279 and a half for a double. No one has pinned that weight yet. <laughs> but is he getting warmed up? Yeah, I think he's getting good warmed up. So we're gonna go ahead and I think we can go there and set up and just see if one of us can move it. Because you have, your technique is not there yet, but your power is definitely there. Just showing how he was pinning it. I think it'd be interesting to, to just see. Because I've never had anybody this tradi it. traditional <laughs> in strength show up here. I mean, what's your biggest bench? What's your biggest competition bench? 675. 675 competition bench. What's your biggest gym bench? 700. You've hit 700 in gym? What's your biggest incline bench? 675. You 675 incline. So what is the biggest incline bench? That. 675. <laughs> I felt like that's it, right? Like, yeah. has yeah. anyone ever done more than that? Uh, if Julius wanted to, he could, but he hasn't yet. But I'm sure he will at some point. How is your incline as strong as your flat? Um, well, competition, competition. Okay, well, okay, either way. So, I mean, 25 pounds off. How do you have such a strong incline? Is it front, delt, shoulders? What is it? Just front, delt, shoulder. I do not work a lot. That's unbelievable. I mean, even when I was strong in... Well, I wasn't strong. I had a 520 raw pinch back when yeah. I was my strongest. My biggest incline was 455. Yeah. So think about that. 220 pounds. <laughs> and I was the strong guy in the gym. <laughs> like I, they're like, oh shit. Okay, right. We're just gonna grab hold of the tip and go. So you're just gonna get here, push as hard as you can, pull as hard as you can, and try to pin it. Yeah. It's gonna be a little. <laughs> if he does this, I'm gonna be like, oh shit. <laughs> this is crazy. All right, so you're gonna have to really tuck your body into this. I mean, get as because I, I don't know if I can do it either. So, but it's going to have to be the hard. You're, imagine the hardest curl you've ever done, the hardest back drag you've ever done, the hardest one arm row you've ever done. He's like, is it welded to the ground? <laughs> you got to pull hard. Just as uh, hard as you can possibly pull. That's close. That's crazy. That's a lot, right? Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> I mean, I can do it. Come on, come on. It actually broke the broke cable. The cable. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure I pinned it. <laughs> I just know the. Uh, I'm gonna have to get some stronger cables and some stronger hooks because I keep breaking shit. Let's, let's make a quick transition. Do you want to try to switch it? Can you curl it? We're gonna see if we can curl it. We can curl it. You might can curl it early. Do it. So, how much is on here right now? Two seventeen. <laughs>
Yeah, I probably can do that. <laughs> so just, just gotta get off the ground, right? Just, just press and get off the ground. <laughs> Did that count? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, try to do it again, man. Yeah. All yeah. right. <laughs> it is opening you up. Oh, big time. We'll go down one. And we'll go up. So this is what? Uh, two. 182. So this is 217? Yes, there'll be 182 to take one off. So even though this would, people would say it's a cheap yeah. or a power curl, this is pretty spot on of what your one rep max would be. Oh, really? Yeah. So I found if you can cheat this, usually you can strict curl it. Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense then because the heaviest strict curl I've done is only like 180. So this is what? 182. You're not going to be, I could have done 675 in a competition. Julius can do 800. Me and Julius, we don't walk around 675, 800 pounds strong all year round. Right. You, have to, you have to go, you know, you have to peak for it. Right. Get it under you, and then you're gonna you're gonna buy you're gonna front delt press. We do realize I just missed the 35 pounds line. That's yeah, right. you're, you're, you were too far back. Get under you, all the way underneath. More, right there. Now, get your no no no. Okay, you get close to your body right here, yeah. and then come that up. That was my intention. <laughs> you're you're curling it. Yeah. Get under it, then lift. <laughs> I have no now that I've drained him a little bit, now we'll go back to the table. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's go back to the table. So elbow on the elbow pad. Set up like your arm wrestle, get it nice and tight. Get your body in a nice step all the way into the table. That's where we're missing. Get a suit as tight as you can to the table. Left hand on the hand peg. Now practice elbow in front of the pad. And drag, practice dragging to the rear of the pad and pinning right here. Be sure to let that fall. We're just working on the technique. There you go. Watch everything you're doing because you're going to end up just two of your arm. Start the wrist straight. Ready to go. Okay. Crank your wrist first. First move. Ready to go. There you go. That's better. Move again. Ready to go. Right, so you, it's just becoming this mechanical arm motion. Okay. Versus just keeping everything nice and tight and driving your body. Ready to go. <laughs> it's amazing that you're that you're, you're just that strong that you're like, come here, no. <laughs> Are you seeing it? Doesn't it look like just this mechanical arm like yeah. you're at the fair and you got the, the guy you arm know, You know who it reminds me of? Who? Lucky's. Very similar. Yeah. Yeah. Hello, so do you know who Richard Lucky's is? Mm -hmm. Okay. Probably one of the strongest human beings to ever walk the earth. He's uh in his sixties now, but he's six one, six two, three thirty, single digit body fat. Freak, right? Farmer from Minnesota, one of the strongest arm wrestlers of all time, just did not, he was not a very good arm wrestler. As far as technique goes, he was just so strong, he grabbed people and go boom. When he literally take people and just push them this way. 
it was, it was it, he would do sit down arm wrestling, which we should get you on the sit down table in a second. That you might be better at that um, because it's more power. And he would just take people and just crush them that way. If someone would have taught him the actual techniques of arm wrestling and how to transition fluidly throughout the, the match, he would probably have been the best arm wrestler ever because his power. Like he'd done, oh, I think he was 300 pounds, strapped 200 pounds to himself and did seven wide grip chins. Crazy. That's unbelievable. You know what I'm saying? And then he weighed 298 with 300 pounds to him and did like five or six dips. Mm -hmm. So 598 pound dips. Yeah. And that's just a really strong human, you know. I've never even, I mean, and his hands are so strong that um, we were praying one time before an event, and in the middle of the prayer, I had to stop and say, Hey, dude, could you please back off my hand a little bit? I mean, that's the guy who's just that strong. So you're resembling that in your in your beginning style of arm wrestling because it's just so traditional for you just to do it that way. Yeah. Let's go ahead and hop on the sit down table and see how, how you pull on that. Ready, go. That's the best you felt yet. <laughs> Yeah. Wait, it's strong yeah. right there. Yeah. Remember to breathe. Yeah. Breathe, 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 breathe. Super strong. I'm gonna try that right now. Try that right now. All right. Ready? Go. That's better. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Yep. Yeah. Push on that hand peg to get that back pressure. See, there's his back pressure. Oops. There's that big strong back. Does that make sense though? Making yeah. a tug of war? All right, so uh, the guy is every bit as strong as I thought he would be. We just gotta fine tune a few things. You could easily see the strength in the uh, the V bar. Yeah. I don't know what kind of curl Hammer. you call it. Crazy Hammer. ass, really hard curl yeah. that, that I'm very, very weak at and he's very, very strong at. So all we gotta do is translate that power to the table. We're gonna have another practice session this evening. We got Paul and Corey West coming. And uh, I'm sure we can get some workouts in while you're here. Yeah. So we, he's here for a couple of days, guys. Uh, good content, great dude. Like I said, be sure to follow him on Instagram. Leroy the Machine Walker. LW. LW, is that what it is? Yeah, LW. LW, all LW right. LW the Machine. LW the Machine. All right, guys, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell for notifications.